Borderlines in Quarantine is a 15-minute spoken word poetry writing challenge by Darren Sandy and Idris Salim. Is now officially a pandemic. We well, here is another episode of Borderlines Inside the Quarantine. And all boom, boom. I'm well, happy to see everybody staying inside. Follow your Prime Minister. He giving you good advice. We're going to use your comments to pick a topic to write on this episode right here. Parents who have no choice but to spend time with their kids. Right, somebody by the name of M that say slap down those people, so I go in with the slap. Journal entry number seven. Oh, oh seventy. Oh, plenty. I'm losing track of time and space. I'm fine in case anyone asks. I have no fever, <clears throat> no cough. Delirium is kicking in and the air is thickening. And I'm certain the little boy I've been observing, who my wife is serving, is beginning to notice that I, I don't know him. I try communicating, but... The pedigree of energy when he plays for days is amazing. He's gravely afraid of bathing. And since the AM, the day when the PM addressed, let's just say I need MTS against his friend request. I can't unlike, unfollow, or unblock. The boy calls himself my son. Someone send some sunblock. The fact is, the amount of time he picks his nose, Lord knows how he hasn't contracted. I ain't good at this. I clearly out of practice. Have me weighing out which one is better. Death or being fair by balancing the pair in parent. I'll quarantine myself over here. Over there, she can fare with the dear one. It's never ending with this gremlin. I can't wait till the date in April when it ended. No extending. I sending him to boarding school. In foreign too. I was in the corner morning this morning to thank the Lord the dwarf was unaware when this one appeared. Daddy, 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 daddy. Oh gosh, look at mother there. Don't judge me. Oh, is it? A lapse perhaps in being a leader? And a certain guilt built in that causes amnesia. While I was on the grind outside holding the skies up, my wife was holding it down inside in spite of. The time inside has exposed some pockets in the Wood family that I never noticed. It's a weird thing how inconvenience could be juxtaposed with the opportunity it poses. Putting focus on what was once unclear. The substance and value gained in holding your loved ones near. <sighs> Looking at your son in his eyes and seeing how he's a photocopy of you in real time. It shouldn't have taken a virus to spread the word that we need time with our loved ones. This is an invitation. Ripped from the tide of metaphors waved on the tongue of Dr. Rowley is a hard slap into sensibility. Sit in quarantine. Wash your hands clean so the slap will be of correction sans COVID-19. Slap yourself out of racism. Slap till your vision narrows on the road to national restoration. Slap petty party politics that take potential explosion on a crisis. Slap fake news flyers. Slap all tongue criers. Slap the sorrowful who sanitize are done. Slap them some soap and water, slap a WhatsApp message to your partner who now come into country but he up and down from tongue to country, slap him back to the scenes of freedom and frolic, the sweat, the beach, the sonic hedge logged in your chest when the pretty girl on the street graced the ghetto by stepping on the ground, now the only girls we see in surgically masked down. Slap yourself song until we set back to fun familiarity, slap a lock on your front gate, throw away the key, slap yourself so hard your mother go feel it slap yourself so hard your neighbors will see this is a time of pain inflicted on all better slap myself inside than get slapped with the stick of sick and fall to a place where no slap could wake slap a long distance tap on a television's host back enough to stern a warning but soft enough to show that even in crap we wish you recovery we are a country where love still overwhelms over the realms of bad press. This slap is without violence. It's a silent, stinging check-in from all of us. Only with united, sanitized hands can we slap the coronavirus. 
We reach the end of another episode, Borderlines in Quarantine. Yeah, come real intense today, boy. Yeah, I feel like this this episode takes some juice out of me, man. Yeah, I feel you have some cheer. I know only that you're uh, getting problems with it. Uh, frustrated, man. Yeah, because <laughs> that poem was. La, <laughs> la, 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 la. I mean, and even if, even if, nobody could really validate whether that is the truth or not. Eh? <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> <laughs> you all remember to like and subscribe and of course hit the notification bell for the lines in quarantine and of course be safe in these times you know the lockdown start. Boom. <laughs>